The Muscle Muster is a community celebration for the efforts that the community gardeners and the school groups have made in growing over 200 kilos of blue mussels. It's a culmination of the 12 months work by the gardeners and they're bringing their baskets in here today. And then they're handing those baskets over to the Binjarab Rangers and they're helping for us to process those mussels so we can take them and put them in a form that can then go out onto the estuary today. One of our biggest things in the Ranger program is to clean all waterways in our region and this is right up our alley. So the blue mussels are going to be doing the ecological heavy lifting in the estuary. They're amazing animals, they can filter up to 100 litres of water a day. And so today we'll be putting out over 200,000 mussels as just part of a trial of developing this shellfish habitat. It's great to have the shellfish reef in particular in the estuary. That acts as habitat for fish. Also if you get a big enough reef and it's in the right place and you can actually get some water quality improvements as well. We are fortunate enough to be supported by the Alcoa Foundation. Alcoa has been involved right from the beginning through our foundation. We've committed more than $1.8 million to date. Initially really working out what needs to be done to improve the estuary, the water quality, biodiversity and fish stocks and then most recently helping the community really be actively involved in growing the mussels that will go out and form those shellfish reefs. We've been lucky to establish around 35 gardens at people's houses and that usually incorporates at least two people from each house so there's at least 70 gardeners. In some cases the grandchildren are helping out as well which has been great. Did it with my pot, yeah you feel like you're contributing to the community and yeah it's good. We also have over 30 children from John Tonkin College and Kootenup College involved. It's a great experience for our students. They get to actually take part in real biodiversity studies. The response from the community gardeners today has shown that the blue mussels can grow really well in this environment here and also just how enthusiastic the community is to have some conservation actions that they can partake in. Everybody seemed to want to get involved. I had lots and lots of my friends that heard me about me doing it and they wanted to get involved as well. And it's a great project. It's good for the estuary, you know, good, good for the community to be doing it.